Well, summer has officially come to a close for Central Lakes College students, as today marked the first day of the fall semester. Reporter Miles Walker went down to the college for the latest. For many students, the first day of class can seem both daunting and overwhelming. That's why CLC is making a concerted effort to help flush out any potential nerves and hesitance. The last couple years with COVID, it's been a little bit of a separation, and I feel this year, um, even as staff and faculty, this whole summer, we've been really excited. Everybody's been coming together. Um, we all touch a student in a certain way, and so we want them to know that uh, they're a part of our family, um, and so we want to provide that experience to all of our students, but I, I can feel it. It's, the energy is back again. Every time I come in this college, I'm amazed at the relationship between all the staff people here and the students. Uh, we're all focused on making this experience as great for the students as it can possibly be. There's a intentionality about it that is tangible around here and I think students notice it. For the first day of class, CLC has placed a heavy emphasis on ensuring inclusivity among its student body. However, this goal was set in motion weeks prior to students returning to campus. Usually the end of July we do an event called All Set for Fall and this event is for um, students to come in and tie up any loose ends. You know sometimes students may apply earlier the year before and maybe they're registering for classes in March or April but they still have questions and they still want to come in so this gives us a time to connect with them. Um, whether they need to change their schedule, tie up any loose ends in financial aid or just any questions whatsoever. And then we had new student orientation on Friday so same thing. Um, this was a little bit more in depth with some workshops and things, but again, just to get students in here, get them prepared, let them walk around, and so that first day isn't quite as scary. Reporting in Brainerd, I'm Miles Walker, Lakeland News. CLC will once again have greeters on campus tomorrow ready to assist any student. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.